can see hear me. I guess uh, that's sorted out. All right, so we have three categories of words, people in network marketing. Number one, the posers, number two, the amateurs, and number three, the professionals. Okay, now who are the posers? Now who are the posers? Now, Now, who are the posers? The posers make what do, now you are you are you, you you can categorize yourself. Now, if you whenever you have a you see a business like in one of our posers or any other network marketing business, and what comes to your mind is uh that I can tell the business person so person hey, for that guy, that guy, okay, that guy. That posers make a mental list of three or four people or five people that will probably join their business. The posers, the posers make a mental list. They make a what? A mental list. So, be, so before they go walk two, three, three, before they do two or three, four activities, they have forgotten the list. How many of us do, do, do some mental lists here? You find yourself doing a mental list. Okay, that guy, that guy, that, that guy, that guy is in a in a market and an element. That guy, that guy goes to be. I go call that guy. I go call that. I'm the boss. Does does that? I used to do that. Person that just of showed the opportunity. You know, uh, my my mentors, Jefferson Santos. Um, taught me well. Mac Morris taught me well. And that has enhanced my business tremendously. No future is big. Now, 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 the sad thing about posers is that the, the, few, the future of your business, you post four persons or five persons that you that you taught in your brain that this guy, they may, I would like that they would join my business. Now, when they don't join, that's that's the end of your career. You just so oh, this business is crazy. How many of us have been there before? <laughs> I've been there many times. Where ah, I call this guy. It, it, it didn't like ah, I call this man. This not no, you hear business who people nobody they join because in your brain, your business, the success of your business depends on. For enough to get one of them, maybe one of them, then the career for a short while. So maybe you now after that five person, one person now join, you now be getting up oh, one person. You are expect that person so that you can become very rich. <laughs> It doesn't work that way. So you put the you put the entire wall of your life and destiny on top of that person. You know, some people the billion coin or crypto any cryptocurrency for that matter, they just put all their problem on top of the cryptocurrency that this team must solve it. So when the when the problem still persists, and I wonder that ah what is going on. You understand? That is a that is a poser for you. 80% of everybody who make mental what mental including my 80 people that join group now instead of a small mental list these people make a written list actually 
Now they are amateurs, but they go for that to to they they write their words. List. This will make a written list. Which is fish. No, now you see a lot of skill and the least diminish after you talk to 80 people. Okay, I think I'm diminishing from 80 to let me see. Yes, say by the time I finish this list, my career will finish. <laughs> now the excitement start diminishing, the excitement starts what diminishing. Now, and like the anxiety grows, what you now become, become anxious. She said, This business, no, you have to ask yourself the questions. She said, This this crypto thing, all the people are not sure, they don't like this, you know. I don't talk to 25 people now already. Ask one, one they say, Short, eight of them say, That's calm. <laughs> then, somebody. So they invest not the common side. Hi. So your anxiety start what? It's the diminishing. <laughs> now, the biggest fear you have when you are an amateur is running out of people to talk to. Running out of people to talk to. I've never been there. Where you are, who do I talk to? Now my list is I've talked to, I've talked to everybody. No, they, they, you generalize. I've talked to everybody. <laughs> okay, you want to have been there. I talk to what? Everybody. Who do I now talk to? <laughs> that was also my fear when I started. Well, I said, who, who do I talk to? Who do I talk to? And that is the purpose of this meeting. Now, professionals, the next phase is the prof professionals. Starts with what? With a written list. And but they decided. What is different between the professionals and the amateur? The amateur start with the written list of maybe 20 people or 100 persons. But the professionals keep increasing the list. The professionals know that the bigger the list, the bigger the chances of their success. So they keep working on their what business. They keep increasing the list. If I show you my list, it's crazy. Looking at their list, by the grace of the network market, two thousand and fourteen. And there have not been any single downtime. When I say downtime, that means, oh, I'm lacking who to talk to because I am continuously building my list. Your, your list is the life wire of your, of your business. Your list is the life wire of your network marketing career. Do you have a list? I'm not forced to have a list. I'm not forced to have a list of contacts that you reach that you you you, you look on look into to reach out to i'm not have a list of contact 
I know some some nerve some just have mentalist. Okay, be, be, I want I want honesty. I'm gonna force have him. I, I'm gonna force a uh, have mentalist. I'm not on paper. They list your contacts. <laughs> See, truly. The list is in your head. It's not on paper. When, when in my meetings, for example, I, sh I, I, I share forms for the purpose of having the contacts, no story. Because the business won't end here. It won't end with this one. Life is a continuous, it's a continuous change. Now, take a look, take a look. This is a list. This is what? All these are lists. I think you can see it very well. They are all lists. This is it's just a partial list. The bundles like this. <laughs> Business. You must consciously create a list that in the next 90 days from today, you should be able to generate minimum of 10 million naira in your bank account. But you must build your list. Now, this is what Steve Harvey has had to say concerning um, how he built a large influence, a large and influential list of people. He said his father sat him down at the age of 18 and said, Harvey, starting from today and for the rest of your life, I want you to take every person you meet, get their contact information, and find a creative way to stay in touch. At the age of 18, the father said, every person you meet, get their contact, phone number, name and phone number, or email address. Just do it as a lifestyle. Don't, it's, a, it's a tiring thing to be asked somebody, uh, what's your name? Find a creative way to what? Get their name, their what? Email address or their, or their phone number. Then find a creative way to stay in touch. Now, he has done th that for over 60 years. Today, he's list of 12,000 people. And these aren't just friends. They are, I consider myself, one Eric War. Now, we'll go to action. We are talking about the ultimate memory jogger. Now we want to jog. Do you have a paper and pen? I want to take a paper and pen. Now let's do let's do some work, guys. This thing I'm doing, this I'm saying is is what I practice over and over again. It's working like fire for me. I can start. If you take me now from here, take me to Kenya. Without my current six months. I will see generates eight figures by God's grace. It's in, I'm talking from inside. I'm not. I don't need. I, you know, practice is different from when you are just uh, uh, um, trying to make something and test. No, no, no. I'm not a, a lecturer. I'm a practitioner. So take your notes. Write the ultimate memory jogger. Ultimate ultimate memory jogger. I want to jog your brain. No jog, you only jog. You jog. I want to jog, jog your brain so that all the contacts you think you don't have, you see, you begin to see contacts. Before you know, you have generated more than 2,000 contacts. Then, in our subsequent meetings, I've been showing you how you can use, how you, how you can do presentation, how you can invite somebody to come and see what you are doing. And I tell you, if you put this into work, in the next 90 days, if you don't make 10 million naira, then you didn't listen properly. 
Okay? Now, step one. Have you written that? The ultimate memory jogger. Now, step one. Now, the step one is make a list, then make it as comprehensive as possible. Yesterday, just this afternoon, let you make now if I do everything and make it comprehensive as what well possible. It doesn't matter if you think they are a prospect or not, your database is one of your most important assets. Everyone. I will do what I'm saying. I take some active one once you see the results. Your mechanic can I guess you are joining with your phone. All you need to do is to. Uh, um, there's a play on your phone. So you just dial, and you should be able to. Okay. Now, if they are negative, put them on your list. If you hate them, put them on your list. If they are your best friend, put them on your list. If you have been involved in network marketing, put them on your list. If they are 90, 98 years old, put them on your list. If they are 18 years old, put them on your list. It is important to empty your mind on paper. Everybody is... Whether that they are part of those who give you trouble in your MLM or you can they they you headache, put them. <laughs> put them on the list. Everybody. Now, somebody in 98, 98 years old that you put on the list may make room for you to connect to a, a 45 years old guy that will explode your business. So don't prejudge, prejudge. Just put them on the list. If you, for example, you begin to think about the cycle, the cycle of friend around the world, your nephew or your cousin. Who do your cousin know? Begin to think about. Oh, your cousin's best best friend is Mike. Oh yeah 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 yeah. And Mike got married to Jane. Oh, that Jane's friend. That Jane's friend. You see it. You, it just says stretching. Just be writing them on the list. Even though you don't know their phone number, just write their names on the list. Write their names on what? On the list. All of this connection will become apparent to you as you make your list more com and more comprehensive. Think about everything. Everything in your life. All those who have made contact with your, your secondary school, primary school, any names you can remember them on the list. Every organization you have been involved in, your first place of work, every group you have been part of, everything you have ever done, just see. Your fire of that is step one. I hope you took that down. That is 
step one. Step two, the second degree of separation. Step two, right? Separation. Even quite it to say the same. Eric Warren, he has been my mentor in this network marketing adventure. I should use book. Step two, the second degree of uh, separation. Uh, you need to get the book if you don't have it. GoPro, or get them. You must know. know who our friends know. Am I right? In most cases. Members of your family, your brothers, your sister, and my younger brother, my elder brother, my, my elder sister, my younger sister. Who do they know? Add them on your word, on your list. Think about your friends. 